Hey everyone, this is One Man Zerg with the UEN.com. I'm giving you another tip today. This one's on ghosts and using their EMP shockwave ability. It's particularly effective against Protoss because it'll take down their shields, but it's also very effective against casters. So if your opponent isn't Protoss, you might still want to get some EMP in case they have infestors or they have a lot of other ghosts or they have a lot of ravens or battle cruisers. It takes off the energy of all of those units. Here he's going to do it versus the Protoss. You see some evenly matched armies here, a lot of Stalkers and Immortal, a lot of Marauders, a few tanks, and a few Marines. Let's see what happens. Protoss player is going to blink in. His units are really clumped right here, so the Terran player is going to focus on that. The blink was a decent move by the Protoss player though because he can close the distance on the tanks without having them siege and without having them do area effect damage on him. Let's see what happens next. The Terran player is going to hit him with an EMP right here. That's going to take out the shields of all these units right here. Maybe some shields remaining on these units, so let's watch the Terran player. He's going to make sure he gets that Immortal. The Immortal shields are the toughest to take down. You can see this Immortal has no shields left now. And that means those Marauders that do 20 damage, typically to the Immortal, are going to get to do that full 20 damage. And it's not going to be halved because the Immortal's hardened shields. So let's see now how this battle plays out. The Terran player still has most of his troops left, and the Protoss player just lost everything. That's how to effectively EMP a Protoss army. Get them when they're clumped together and drop a couple EMPs to make sure you got the whole army. So you drop one here and drop one here when they were in close range and they were fighting. Ideally, you'll want to do the EMP right before the battle begins, but doing it right at the start of the battle or before you've got to those units. You saw the Terran player kill the units from this side to this side. So that first EMP, he, he hit that first and then he killed those units. Then he EMP'd over here and hit those units. That's exactly how you want to do it. Take out the units right after you've emp them so you get the maximum effect from that EMP and then you get to waltz through with the rest of your army. I hope that tip serves you well. Go to the UEN.com for more tips and strategies and subscribe to the YouTube channel if you want to as well. Thanks for listening.